All right, so as you can see in the laundry room, and you wonder why, well, you probably read the title, but my biggest tips, my three biggest tips for your first powerlifting meet, and I'm probably gonna have my friends who are more experienced and definitely been in more meets chip in, so I'll give you one, and then I'll try to get them to give the other two, or how many ever, so. Number one, pro tip. Start light. And I mean very light. And, yeah, just open up light, man. Just, just do it, just do it, man. At my last meet at uh, Qualifiers for Nationals, this kid who was easily gonna win, he was destroying everyone in the squat and the bench, and then his deadlift, he bombed out. He lost, didn't even place. I did high, I got, technically, I did better than him, and he destroyed my numbers, but he bombed out. I am serious. Whatever you do, do not bomb out. You got it? Good, get it, got it, good. For me, I fin let me give you like perspective. I, on my deadlift, I finished with 397. My opener was like 317. It's just, you don't know how you're gonna feel on the day. And even if you, you peaked right and you're feeling great and you're even kind of conservative, you never know if something happened during squats if something happened during bench and just like you got hurt or like something tweaked a little or like it just went bad, so like you never know. It doesn't hurt to start light. You can always do a big jump second attempt. Just don't bomb out. Start light. Get the confidence up, especially if it's your first meet. Me, I didn't know how I was gonna squat without a mirror or like have commands. I was like mad nervous. So a lot of different things. So I, even my coach was trying to get me high, I was like, no, I know myself. Let me start real low. Get like my first ones like looking speedy. And then we'll go from there and just just start light, man. There's no other way to say it. Like, be conservative, all right? So that's my tip. Start super light, get the confidence up. Don't bomb out. That's a huge tip right there. Um, and yeah, so I'll see you guys when I find, I'll probably ask my coach to give you the second tip and then someone else for the third. We'll, We'll figure it out, but just know, you're gonna become meat ready after this video. All right, so we got Coach Wally here, rolling out. What's, what's your tip for someone's first piloting meet? All right guys, if you go to a meet, bring a friend. Come prepared, bring food, what else? Bruh, it's one tip. Oh, okay. So what, what, what's your one tip? My number one tip is to bring a friend to help you pick attempts. That's my number one tip. He was there for me, you guys. He, he was my friend, he was my coach. He picked my attempts. Keep the freshman. I did everything, JK, he didn't do shit. All right, so we got my boy Daniel. He's about to do his first meet soon. And so Dan, Danny, what are you thinking going into your first meet? What's the one tip you'd give people that you're focusing on? Focusing on not trying to fuck up the commands. Okay. And the lifts don't count. Yeah, I rack, them to count. practice commands a lot. A lot, a lot of people, a lot of people miss <laughs> Rack command, the down command. One of the kids on our team is the down command for his final deadlift that he would have placed first in the meet, but fucked yeah, up. Don't want to do that. Don't, don't want to do that. All right, Danny's gonna kill us first meet. All right, we got my homie Rambo. He's black, so, so bring some diversity to the channel. So, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Rambo, what's your tip for the pilot thing? First one. Uh, first tip out the gate, just just have fun. You know, you might not go nine for nine, but you know, whatever you do, just go in there. You know, going with a bunch of friends. And, uh, just have a blast that day. Don't stress it, man. Just have fun. That's why we got into lifting in the first place, right? There you go. For the from titties. That's how I did it. All right, moving over. Got my homie Max. He's very strong. He's very bald. If you couldn't tell. So, Max, what's your tip? Make sure you leave with a swole mate. She's okay. Just, she's gonna give you some motivation. Increase testosterone. Inspiration. And give you a couple numbers on your PR, so always leave with the swole mate. Are you my swole mate? Can we kiss on the camera? <laughs> All right, back in my room, rocking the hat, not the headband, but uh, going off what Max just said, he was obviously joking for the fifth one, and then he, he was talking to me after, and he's just like, no, but really, like, tell them for my tip that you should learn something from your meat. So every meat you go to, no matter how much you prepare, how much you already think you know, or even if you do know a lot, it doesn't matter. Even all the greats, especially for the first meet, just learn something from it. So 
no matter what you do, just know what you can do better for the next one. Even if you're 10 meets in, you've had 20 years of lifting under your belt, you should learn something from every meet. Whether it's like talking to people, picking their brains, just uh, connecting, just anything. Anything you've done, oh, maybe this works for me, this doesn't. Maybe I should eat this before. It, it doesn't matter. Just learn something from every, every meet you do and just pick something up because knowledge is power and strength is never a weakness. So this is super training, just kidding. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so that's the top five. I'll put the list down here again so you guys can like just see it and see the order or whatever. But yeah, this video was more loose, just asking around my friends in the gym, all very strong, knowledgeable people. So that's the top five tips for your first powerlifting meet or just meet in general. And so I hope you guys take from this and learn and hopefully can implement it when you guys do your meet. And that's going to be all for today. So if you like the tips, please like the video. Maybe comment some tips you have of your own that we didn't say. Because there's obviously more. There was just, we only went through five. So if you have experience like with like one big thing that you think helps, let me know. Because, hey, I've only done one me. I can, I'm still learning. I do not by any means know like more than anyone else. So definitely leave your tips in the comment section. Please subscribe so you see more videos like this. We're coming at you Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Sunday, fam. And share the video. Peace.